this is what your oxtail should look like. Mama Joan oxtail falling off the bone. A bubble, yeah, bubble, a bubble, yeah, bubble. Welcome, welcome to Mama Joan house where it's hot. And when I said hot, it's hot like a scotch bonnet pepper. Today, guys, I'm gonna teach you how to make oxtail. Oh, I make it where it slow cook in the oven and it's melting off the bone. So, for starters, I have some fresh oxtail here that it's already pre-washed. And then I have um, my seasoning. So for the ingredients for the oxtail, I'm gonna have some tomato, ball pepper, which is red, yellow, and orange ball pepper. Two carrots, four clove of garlic, a scotch bonnet pepper, and two fresh bay leaf. This bay leaf is from my garden. And then I have some fresh thyme, also from my garden, and some onion. And I also have some green onion. So what I am going to do with these now, I'm gonna put them in my blender. So I'm gonna blend all these ingredients to put it on my oxtail. So guys, these are all my ingredients and you need, I use a cup of water and I use a little browning because the browning have to get some color, okay? Not too much, can okay? I want it bitter? So I would say use about a, a tablespoon of browning. So, but me I judge the browning right about now, okay? So we use a tablespoon of browning and then me I'm gonna give this a whisk. That's what it smells like, my youth, okay? Okay, guys. Now, they're gonna make a little noise, so. over my ox tail see how that look oh my gosh look at that richness I'm gonna use some allspice uh, some Mrs. Dash some garlic plus all and some garlic and herbs so I'm gonna sprinkle some of that inside of it. so now I'm just sprinkling some of the seasoning over that and a lot of people might say, oh, this woman don't use no oxtail seasoning. I don't need to use oxtail seasoning. I just make my seasoning. That is my seasoning. My, all of my spices and stuff that I blend together. That's it. Now, I'm going to give it a whisa, 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 whisa. I mean, a stir, a stir, a stir. Well, they call it a whisa, whisa. Okay. So let's stir this together. Oh, you see, look, 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 look on that meat. Look how that meat look. Look how pretty it look. This is where you call seasoning your meat, guys. This is when you season your meat. Real Jamaican style season. It's only for powder, powder thing. No work, I only for blood pressure that. Fresh seasoning. Most of it is from my backyard, that. My tomato and all of that, and my pepper. All right, guys. So, this is my seasoning. Now, let me usually make it sit and marinate for a two hour so it will seasoning. So the seasoning can soak in it and then we throw it in the, the oven. Guys, two hours now. So, on the no set, the tail will seasoning. And it ready to go in the oven. 
So look, everything all soaking at it. So we are gonna throw it out and we are gonna put it in the pot. And we are gonna stick on the seat. When it's done. So this is as the man has said. Sim Sima. This is me hack steel. Nah, maybe ma. Well ready. <laughs> nice and spicy. Nice and spicy. Well seasoned. Good for you guys. If you do this. My way. Mama. J way. You know. Me I tell you no. You see when this cook, we are gonna go now look pan it when it just start bubble. You know. You know the fat, you know, when they have said, a bubble, 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 okay, all right, <laughs> okay, so here we go, I have my oven at 400 degrees, so I put it in, and I put it in uncovered, so go ahead, be like that uncovered for the first hour, and I'll get back to it, and Story time, let you guys see how it's going. Alright. Okay, Mr. Camera man. Okay, now that's my first stir. So I'm gonna stir my tail. Give my tail a stir. Still tough enough. I don't understand how people can cook a steel pan stove in an hour. Axel is a very tough meat. When I say tough, me mean it hard because I'm the tail of the cow. You know what I'm saying? So, you see people cook the tail of the cow and then cook it in a one hour and not no go so. The tail of the cow needs some time for cook. You know, so we give it a turnover and we are gonna throw it back in the oven. Look on the axel girl, guys. Look how it's pretty. Look how it pretty. Look how it pretty. Look there. I do a bone. It have enough meat on it. Enough meat on it. And I be a bone and I be a meat. Me as not no bone. As you can see, guys, look at the ox tail. It's just from the oven, not on the stove. It's not ready, but this is what it is like after an hour so i'm gonna give it another hour in the oven and when i take it out it'll go well and ready to put the beans in because remember you know we got to put the butter bean in there that is another vital part you know to put some butter bean in there so look at it and look oh a pretty a prettier than money Okay, now we're coming to the finishing product. Come close and make the people's them seize it. Or oh, a bubble, it's a bubble. It's just a bubble, just a bubble, just a bubble, just a bubble. So see, nice, soft, and falling off the bones. Oh my gosh. This is what your oxtail should look like. Mama Joan oxtail falling off the bones okay guys there you go okay guys now we come to the end of the video i hope you guys like my oxtail and try it and i would like it to give this video 10,000 likes so this is mama joan house and i will see you in the next one